Hey guys, um, I have a real quick video for you guys. Um, so the Lord's had me been resting for for like a day or two. You know, whenever you're like you've been so tired, right, and you just like want to break, and everything keeps going like hardcore to the max. Staying up late, like showering at two in the morning, start again at five, type thing. <laughs> That was how everything was going, and um, I'm still waking up at like 5 a.m., but um, but the Lord has put me in a time of rest. Yes, there's a thunderstorm behind me, so the Lord's speaking right now, guys, speaking through me, and uh, <laughs> through his thunder. Um, I had a dream like years ago, probably five or six years ago. And in the dream, I was at this house. The house was like, it was super nice and elegant, right? It was really, really nice. And I remember the detail in there and seeing the kitchen and the bedrooms and stuff. And it was just, it was huge, okay? There was two of everything, two bedrooms, two living rooms, two kitchens, and two everything. So it was a twin home, twin home. And uh, there's more to this dream. I haven't broke it down. I should have. Lord. Oh, yes, Lord. I will look into it. Okay, so. In this dream, I'm at this party at this house, okay? My husband's throwing it for me, and I'm, like, super happy. After we've been inside for a while, we go outside to the beach. And this is what it looked like. Um, everyone had Chinese lanterns, and some of the kids had, like, balloons, okay? Side note, I already tried to make this video earlier, but it got messed up, interrupted. And then Dr. Barry All came out with his video about the balloon, and, um, I want to add this in here that my son had had a, a dream about this balloon floating up to the ceiling and him following it and going up into the ceiling and when he did, Jesus was up there, and, um, like, he was flying, and he looked down, and he freaked out, and he fell. And when he fell, he screamed and woke up. But I was waking him up at the same time. Does that make sense? So, um, the connections here are really interesting. So random. Um, but we're out there with these Chinese lanterns, and we all let them go. And, like, this music's on. It's all beautiful and nice. And then all of a sudden, the place is just in, in like, utter chaos, okay? Like, something big happened, but I don't know what it was. I turned around to get my backpack and go, to go inside and get my backpack. And um, I passed this girl in a wheelchair. And when I came back, she was still in the same spot. And so I was, like, worried about her because she, I looked like she didn't know what to do. Um, but I saw a bridge in the water, in the ocean, and this bridge was underwater, but, but some of it wasn't, and it looked like a maze, it was so small and, like, rickety, I didn't know if I'd even make it across, so I'm looking at it, but then I, I hear the Lord tell me, like, you have to take the person in the wheelchair, or you won't make it. And I'm thinking, oh my gosh, how am I going to do this? So I get the girl in the wheel with the wheelchair, and we go up to this um, this bridge, and um, then I wake up. So that was the dream, and um, then the Lord started speaking to me whenever all this like milk and honey stuff came up and Samson's story. Well, the Lord told me He wants me to take sweet milk and honey. And um, put it into a Chinese lantern that I've prayed over. So I bought um, like a set of Chinese lanterns. And um, I'm going to pray over them. But the coolest part is that... Okay, so before I had the stream, we, know we hadn't gone on any of these vacations or anything like that. Um, that wasn't even like... A possibility for us because we were so broke and poor um, at the time but 
now my husband all of a sudden decided he wanted to take us on vacation and we were going to go up 4th of July but then we decided to go later on in the month um, because we got a better place just it was all better all around well my husband ends up getting a condo right out there by the beach <laughs> right out there by the beach and um and so August 16th, 17th, 18th, 19th, and I think the 20th, I'm going out there, but I think I want to put them, I think I'm going to do them on the 17th, because the Indo Rapture, I feel, started um, on 717, so I'd like to do it on 817, I think, unless the Lord, you know, specifies the date and time, but, um, so, whenever I got to thinking about it, okay, I knew the Lord was telling me to do this. And I was so excited. Because, I'm so excited now because I've never been told to do anything symbolic or just anything like that, you know? And I've, told, I've been told, like, do, do my YouTube channel, and I did. And, you know, I try to say yes to Him on every single thing. And so, this one was like, I had to ask my husband to buy these things for me. And, uh, but he did it. It's so sweet. He still, he still bought them for me, still made a way. And, um, and so whenever I go to look up, all right, my husband made all the plans. My husband got the condo, all of that. But it turns out we, we were, the, we've been going for the last four years or so. Let's see, um, years ago, we were pretty broke, okay? So we can't really go on vacation. But if our parents came down and stuff, we, we went with them, right? So about four years ago, one of our parents ended up always coming down at this same time frame. And we would go to the beach. And so it's a repeat, right? Well, what's really cool is I go, like my husband made all the plans. So I go to look at this place, okay? This is... Actually, it's right here. This is the the condominium right here. Um, at Tropic Winds. And, like, I'm going to do a video out here, guys. The view is beautiful. It is beautiful. Like, I'm so thankful to get to go. Um, right at the time when the Lord's, like, telling me, rest, rest. I think something big 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 is coming and um we do need a rest we need to be prepared be prepared i heard in my spirit guys just a bit ago i heard warfare 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 like that like it just kept going and i was like oh my gosh warfare you know <laughs> so and think about that it's not he's not saying like war he's saying warfare warfare you know but um i thought this was cool first off it's a 145 mile drive it did say 144 um <clears throat> whenever i typed in the exact address that it took me but then i accidentally clicked around it and it i had to get it back to to at least somewhat where i had originally had it okay but then i started looking up some of these numbers over here 